Good afternoon, Heidi. Brian Gallegos here from Wrestler Motors in Bozeman, Montana. I just want to reach out and say, first of all, thank you for your inquiry on the 2020 Silverado 3500. Uh, we just brought this one in, so uh, it's got to go through our pre-delivery inspection. That's why I'm not in front of the dealership right now, but wanted to come over here and shoot you a quick video, show you some of the bells, some of the fun whistles. Now, this one does have the gooseneck fifth wheel prep package you get the bed liner with that you get that nice new dura bed lots of extra space you can see back here you got your seven and your four pin for your uh gooseneck or your fifth wheel you've also got an led light in that corner i'm coming around over here got another led light 120 volt outlet so we can uh we can run some power tools out of this sneak in between here I love the addition of the sidestep. I think that's phenomenal. You know what else is pretty awesome? Look at that. Chevy move the daft tank. I love it. Coming around to the back seat, you can see we do have tons of space. It's pretty much flat back here, which is really nice. That's for your engine block heater. I'll show you where that goes in just a moment. You've also got the vents in the back here, USB, USB-C, and a 12 volt outlet. Now, come up here. I want to show you one of my favorite new features on this instead of snaking that engine block heater through the radiator and having all that mess of cord i'm gonna actually plug in right here how awesome is that they make life just super easy super super easy you got the passive door locks on here so as long as the key fobs in your pocket or your purse you can open it up uh, just by pushing that button now we're gonna squeeze in here I'm gonna start it up for you real quick and show you some of the fun bells and whistles that we got going on in here. Yes, I love that sound so much. Absolutely love it. All right, so this is our driver information center, right? So I'm gonna go over to our homepage. That's gonna show zero miles per hour, 97 miles till empty, 162 miles on the truck. Scrolling over to here, this is gonna be our trip A, trip B, uh, fuel range, engine oil life, tire pressure sensor, air filter life, brake pad life, uh, average fuel economy, fuel filter life, death levels, you name it. We're also gonna have the ability to manipulate our audio settings, navigation, and phone all right from here, which is just a nice feature. I absolutely love it. Two high, four high, four low options right here. This is gonna be to switch over into tow haul mode. Just turn that to the left, you can see that little trailer icon pop up these are going to be the lights these are the uh led lights in the back that i was telling you about there's also one right above the uh the cab which is super nice as well as those task lights on the side those ones right there which will shine down the side of the truck and then you've got your task lights right here which are on the front of that mirror should you need to see anything uh, at night that way. We got a heated steering wheel on here, clutch on those cold days, I'll tell you what. Cruise control options right here, hands-free calling right here. This is our infotainment center. You've got the ability to pair your phone via Bluetooth, right? We can listen to our audio uh, from our phones on there. Uh, you get a Wi-Fi hotspot with this with OnStar, which is absolutely incredible. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Um, so you're gonna have the ability to plug your phone in here to this USB port and you're going to have access to a lot of your applications on your phone. So you're going to have access to text messages, to Google Maps, to uh, uh, weather, to all sorts of fun stuff. Audiobooks, like you name it, for those long car rides, which is super cool. And then we got a trailering app right here. So in the My Chevrolet app, you can set up different trailer profiles. So if you're towing several different things, um, you can set up each trailer profile in there and then you don't have to mess around with the gain, the output on this integrated trailer brake. Every single time you get in, it'll just remember it. It'll also have a checklist on there, which is super handy because it'll tell you the things that you absolutely have to check and then you can add to that. You can say, don't forget my Yeti cooler. Uh, don't forget my fishing license. Uh, don't forget my lucky hunting rifle, whatever it might be. You can add all of these things uh, into that checklist, which is super handy. Now I want to show you the cameras on this thing. So we've got our traditional backup camera here, and then we actually have a bed view camera so we can see what's going on in the bed. Uh, super handy when you're backing up and hitching up your fifth wheel or your gooseneck. And then we've got a trailer hitch camera right here, which makes life so dang easy. I love it. 
Coming down here, we got dual climate control for the uh, driver and the passenger. So if you run hot and they run cold or vice versa, uh, you can set those however you want. And then we've got heated seats on both sides as well. This is for your back, that's for your back and your booty. Exhaust brake is here. Um, this button's really nice. If you need to grab something out of the back, uh, you can actually push that button and the tailgate's gonna go down automatically. There's also a button on the key fob that if you click twice, the tailgate will go down automatically while we're here. That's gonna be a remote start. So you do have remote start with this as well. Uh, hazards here, this is our traction control. This is going to be the button you're gonna press if you want to engage power to either this outlet or the outlet in the back that I mentioned earlier. And since this is a Z71, you've got your downhill uh, descent right there. With the Z71, you also get Rancho shocks. Uh, you get a two-speed transfer case, locking differential, and skid plate underneath the transmission. How cool is that? Coming down here, got tons of storage space here, as well as in here, little rails here for file folders if you're gonna be using this for work. You've got your USB, USB-C, auxiliary, and then right there's a spot for a SIM card where you have the ability to, uh, to put navigation on this vehicle. So this one doesn't come standard, but it comes with the option of it which is super cool and then ba -da -da, look at that so nice on a day like today that sunroof i absolutely love it sunroof right there and then whoop let's sneak around to the back here rear sliding back window with rear defog uh now this truck well she's a beaut she also does work let's sneak over here I want to show you down here. I love that GM has added these little stickers. Let's see if I can get it just right. There we go. So you got a conventional trailer weight rating of 20,000 pounds, excuse me, and the max trailer weight rating with your gooseneck uh, fifth wheel of 21,100 pounds. That's the beauty of that Duramax Allison combo, especially now that it's got the 10 speed Allison transmission, you get those torque multipliers. Anyways, Heidi, I could ramble for days about this truck because I absolutely love it. Love to invite you down, take a look at it, take a test drive with me. Uh, Wrestler Motors. Again, my name is Brian. Give me a call, 218-259-2282. Shoot me a text, whatever's clever. I appreciate your time. Look forward to hearing from you and working with you soon.